Mr. President, fellow members of the Iowa Senate, it is with great measure of pride I rise to support Senate File 2109, or as it has been called today, Jeremiah's Law. Many times during my service in this superb body, we have been called upon to remedy situations, fill holes in lives, bridge gaps in legislation. Today we have that opportunity again to make something right, to do something better, to improve an oversight. Last May when Jody Dozier met with me and told me the story of her son's life and death, I could tell she was very proud of her son and very sad at the circumstances that took his life when someone ran a red light and hit Jeremiah's motorcycle. Compounding the grief she felt was the knowledge that the penalty for this act was the equivalent of a slap on the wrist, stinging a little bit, but not a deterrent at all. She asked me what could be done, and I was proud to facilitate her contacts with Senator Kryman, Departments of Public Safety, staff, and our Judiciary Committee. Thanks to the conscientious work of those folks and many others who saw the need to correct an injustice, we are now heading down the finish line of a process to take corrective action. Those who, for whatever reason, run a red light and cause injury or death should know that their actions will result in a more simple, a severe penalty than a parking ticket. I urge your support for Senate File 2109, Jeremiah's Law, and I want to thank Jody Dozier, who is in our gallery today to witness our votes, and her husband, Rick, for being that concerned citizens that make a difference for passionate measures such as these.